It is so soul satisfying to walk the fields, to see where our food comes from. It's just so inspiring then to use the whole animal, to have such fresh, amazing product, to cook this bird over open fire. I mean, this is, it does, it just feeds the soul. I love everything about hunting. I did not grow up hunting. My parents don't hunt and my immediate family didn't hunt and so I actually didn't start hunting until a few years ago. And I really wanted to know more about where my food came from. I wanted to have that connection with the food that I eat. And so that was what originally brought me into hunting and I love being outdoors, I've always enjoyed that, and so it was just a bonus that I got to spend days outside. Um, well, and if I didn't harvest anything, I, I didn't care. I mean, it was just the time being outdoors with friends or by myself with my dog, and good a reason to get outside, even if the weather wasn't great, when other days I probably wouldn't, wouldn't go out in the cold, and just forces you to go places that maybe you wouldn't, and during times that you, you wouldn't as well. So it's, there's really nothing like it. I'm Clayton Chapman. I am in the Rainwater Basin in the southeast corner of Nebraska uh, with some great folks at Pheasants Forever. So Pheasants Forever has been around since 82 and it started as just a grassroots organization where just some volunteers were interested in providing habitat for pheasants. We work with a lot of private landowners, but we also work really heavily with partners uh, to secure more funding for wildlife and uh, enhance the private land and public land for pheasants, quail, and, and pollinators, and, and all sorts of wildlife. We're, we're definitely just trying to make a difference on the landscape and trying to work with all the different landowners, all the different types of landowners to conserve their land, conserve their soil, um, and also benefit pheasants and quail. I'm thankful. I'm, I'm thankful to be part of this Midwest food story. I'm thankful to be out in the field. I'm thankful for the birds that we found. Learning about pheasants in Nebraska has been very satisfying. And the quail and the, I mean, approach that the two girls take as individuals, but really like the approach that Pheasants Forever takes as an organization, their land cultivation. It's not just about the birds, but it's about the entire ecosystem of this area. It's about the pollination, it's about the land management, the waterfowl production, the grouse production. I mean, it's just, it's all encompassing. And it's been really inspiring to learn. It's made me appreciate this part of Nebraska so much more. I haven't spent a ton of time in the Rainwater Basin, uh, but it's, it's beautiful. I mean, look, look around me. It's, I mean, it's just, it is, it's, it's awe-inspiring.